For homeowners, there's always one more chore to do, but our credit union gives you a hand. With a home equity loan, you control the projects. Our credit union gives homeowners options when choosing a loan with us. Border Federal Credit Union, serving the community since 1954. Stop by, give us a call, or visit us online at borderfcu.com. Insured by NCUA. Everybody, I'm Larry Ramirez with Case Outdoor Sports, and you are watching the Other Guys Sports Show.
mighty javelinas. Go, go Hans, go! go. My test, my test. Okay, I think we're on. <laughs> Welcome to the other guy's sports show. Myself, Bobby Castillo, Robert Martinez, and my son, Bobby Castillo Jr., doing the camera work. And Adelia might join the camera crew. Some sideline uh, angles there. Yes. So, the tip off will happen in the next few minutes. They're doing introductions right now. Let me show you some. Uh, the bracket situation where we're at right now at the moment. You can see there, Crit City were victorious against the Petit Aggies, 57 to 28. And Columbus all over Nixon's mining, 78 to 20. And we're facing here in the area championship, live here in San Antonio. What's the name? Uh, it says um, Lady Littleton. Is it Lady or is it? No, Jimmy. Jimmy, Jimmy Littleton. Uh, Jimmy Littleton Gymnasium. It's a nice here, kind of north of uh, the airport. Yeah, it's uh, this building was built back in 1966, Robert, and there's been major updates, but you do get that old feel of, you know, that back in the day. Yeah, it's nice. So it's, uh, capacity is like 5,000 people here. Of course, we're not going to meet that capacity, but it is, it's a large gymnasium, one of the biggest ones I've seen here. As you can see here on the screen, you can see this is the matchup in the total records of the Howlinas. Uh, overall, Howlinas are 21 and 13, and uh, well, Columbus is 27 and 4. So, uh, good to show you there. And you know, on paper, we are clearly the underdogs, but I still feel like we have a good chance, you know, to to yes. to be victorious. Let me show you here. These is the standings where Columbus come from. This is the, their district standings. You can see. They're a perfect 14-0 in district. So I, I would like to see, Robert, I mean, I think we match up physically. We just have to worry about number five here, the center. Oh, it's going to start already. Let's go to the action here. First possession. Ah, mishandled the ball. So number zero, number 12. Number 12 is considered, a, you know, a, their best ball handler for Columbus. There we go, Reina Martinez leading this fast break here. Let's see what she does here. It looks like the, the camera from the score froze, I guess. It stayed at 12. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let me take it off. We'll, we'll fix it in a second. Mm -hmm. So we'll put, we'll put the... I'm to go. Mess no. with it. I'll, I'll go, Rob. So it's 721 starts. Still no score here. Mm -hmm. First basket for the Javelinas. One thing that clearly Columbus or the Cardinals, they do have height. Number five. We were talking off camera that uh, the Columbus are really known for their volleyball team. Right. Have gone deep in the playoffs multiple years. I think one of the areas here for victorious for the Javelinas is that we need to have a quick first quarter. We tend to be slow on the first quarter. Uh, Robert, we did a lot of talking on the road here, and we need to give all that anal analytics we're doing. What is the key things the Lady Havanians need to do to get a victory on this game? Well, we need to have a fast start, faster than this past Tuesday. And uh, I would like to open up the three-point line, open up the paint by shooting three points uh, more consistently, or at least attempting them more. If we can shoot 10 in the game, that'll be great. Um, and also, uh, be more careful with passing the ball. Right. We, you know, we, definitely. We, well, right now we're with a 2-0 lead, Robert. Who was the first basket? I didn't even get to see that. Oh, I, I wasn't paying attention. So we're up 2-0. And number 12, the shooter here. And, and Columbus, the Cardinals here, just passing the ball around and then driving. I think they want to get number five involved. I think so, and which is smart, though. You want to definitely take advantage of your height. Close to a travel no call there. Yeah. 
And I know during the angle view, you know, the rails and the way, that's, that's really the best we can do on in that situation. Right. I think we can zoom in a little bit closer. Let me see if we can zoom in. It's kind of far. Yeah, Robert. I feel like we need to start hitting those three-pointers and Huerta there trying to meet that call there. So the Cardinals still looking for the first basket of the game. One thing I was looking at the stats, pretty much we average the same amount of points. I think the Cardinals uh, score a little bit more points, but pretty much I think we're uh, offensively wise, we're pretty much uh, match up fairly well though. So I feel that defense is going to be a major key here for the Javelinas. Yeah. Too strong there. Looks like we're going to the. Yeah, so Flores will be on the line. Shooting two, uh, gives number five her first foul there. Let me disconnect the camera, Bobby. Maybe you'll connect it back now. Yeah. Camera one here. Mm -hmm. And it, we're, it's set to auto connect, so. There you go, Rob. There we go. There we go. There it is. So two free throws made, Robert. And that's key also. There's another element. We gotta make the free throws. Yeah. Mm. Great steal there with Havelina. Oh. oh. There looks like we're not in the same page there on that one. Yeah. Those are the easy baskets we gotta take advantage of. So we come out of the press here. Good defense there. One oh, looks like they're reaching there by number four. Who is that? Huerta. Number five on the, on the foul. Oh, they called it? Number yeah. five? Oh, okay. I was surprised. Let me see if we can zoom in a little bit more here. Mm -hmm. I can't do it from here. Let's see Reina, who she targets here. Let's see if we can get a nice uh, look at the basket. And taking a double team oh. there in the corner. Nice pass. Oh, missed opportunity there for Reina. Number four lines it up. Oh, it looked good from this from this angle. Rebound, oh, stole the ball. Oh, that would look good. Yeah, I know. I'm glad there we were able to make it here. Thank you for watching the other guys' sports show. If you do me a favor, be sure to subscribe in the other guys' sports show. Our goal for the season yeah. is to hit a thousand subscribers. We're so close, and we also welcome any Columbus fans also joining the broadcast. Yes. Good steal there, 12. Oh, our team was getting back on defense fairly well, but number two able to connect there, Thomas, that's for the, Columbus. That's the first basket of the game for yeah, the Cardinals. Cuts the lead to half, Robert, with one shot. Alvarado gets to Flores. Flores, Good a nice shot. shot there. A beautiful 15-footer from the side. Looks like that's her shot right there. Yeah. Flores has got to be one of our most improved players we've had. Oh, and one on that one. Great position there for the Cardinals, number five. Yes. And number five, Robert, um, talking to the coach. She's committed to UTSA already. In volleyball, right, though? In volleyball. Uh -huh. But the coach thinks that she can play basketball as well. She's a, but she's a junior. I know we talked about it off camera that in volleyball, we we're so close to facing them uh, on the second yeah. round, but you know we lost in the first round against the Poteet, Poteet right? Yeah, I, I think we definitely had that game, and we could have given Columbus a run for their money earlier this year. <laughs> on volleyball? Yeah. Well, well, why not? And they went deep yeah. in the playoffs. I think they were there. I think they were telling me in the semifinals, so they yeah. were... And I asked uh, one of the broadcasters here that if they won state and volleyball, not yet, they'd be so close. 
A lot of contact there. Oh, jump off. Wow. <laughs> A lot of contact there. Yeah, so 6-5. Chris City maintaining a one-point lead. Let's see what Alvarado makes her come back here, Robert. So screen and roll. Alvarado looking to, to feed Flores there. Yeah, that was... It looked like she was yeah. going out of bounds and threw it yes. at her legs, but was able to move out of the way there. So Olivares comes in. So on the floor for Chris Didi, we have Alvarado, Olivares, Flores, Martinez, and Bosques. Good screen there, number three. Great, they're getting out of a uh, double team there. Yeah. Nice. Oh, oh you gotta make those. We gotta make those. Yeah. Great she, move there. Yeah, she had great position, but she moved to the other side of the basket. I think she could have just gone up. I think the two. I think she was worried about being blocked. Yeah, she she thought about it, mm -hmm. and that's what the presence does, you know. Oh, Livares can line it up, and there it looks good. We got seventy-four people watching. Thank you, mm -hmm. watching the other guys' show. The city maintaining nine-five now. Talking to the coach from from Columbus, Robert is Mike Albers, and his son is the assistant coach. So it's like that's pretty cool. And that's yes, nice. Uh -huh. And Jen Chester, the, the another assistant coach, Coach Cardona, and talking to him before this game, you know, felt real confident that if they do the game plan, they should be in this game, Robert. And kudos to him to to building that confidence because it's a minute and twenty six to the end of this first period and Chris City maintaining a lead. Oh. So kudos to him, Ali Tribe on the line, number five. And for the most part, they've done a decent job kind of containing number five right. on during the paint though. We just gotta maintain that throughout four periods here. I think so too, just put bodies after bodies kind of uh, Get close to her, you yeah. know, make make her child uncomfortable. Number one now back in for Chris City. Oh, Flores. Rebound. Good rebound there for Bosques. Gets the rebound. Only a lot by four now. Oh. A ball back to the Javelinas. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The back is open. Yes, Flores able to connect for Chris City. You know, the back's uh, always open here late in San Antonio. Yes. Good pass there. Mm. Now this is the area rebounding. I've some rebounding. It's going to be a challenge throughout the game here. Yeah. So here, you know, when you, especially you're uh, size-wise, you're overmatched. This is where the fundamentals comes in. You know, box right. out properly. Right. Push out your so foul on, on Bosque is there. For, but I thought it was the number five shooting, but it's zero on the line. And Upson is is one is their senior point guard, and and the leader for this basketball team for Columbus. Number five. Yes, number zero. Number zero. Uh -huh. Oh, bad pass there. Fifty oh. seconds here. Yeah, this this area back. we gotta yeah. clean up here a little bit. Right. So on the floor we have Huerta, Flores, Olivares, Rios, and Bosques here for. Looks like it might wait. Mm -hmm. Hold on for the last one. Maybe not. No, no. They, oh, she lost the ball. So it might be Columbus nerves here. Oh. Might be Bosque's second personal foul. So yeah. something to kind of keep an eye on. Yeah. 
So 33 seconds on the clock, Robert, and I'm glad that the camera is working for the clock, right? So Yes, the clock is working good. So number two coming in for Chris City, Mata, our freshman. Looks like Columbus is closing the gap here now, down by two now. All right. 30 seconds. See if we can get a good basket here. I'm not sure we're going to hold on for the last shot of the game or looks like that might be the case. Oh, Rio's not able to, to shoot over number five there. Yeah, that's why I want Rio to yeah. you know, give a little bump there. Eight seconds. Number 12 lines it up. Oh. And hits a three, Robert. And, and that's the first lead of the game here. Yeah. And nice. like that, they say they take the first period, yes. 12 to 11, Robert. Yes, let's take a quick break, Bobby. Yes. I think it's Back, Bobby. All right, we're back here. The end of the first period, Robert, 11, 12. Columbus takes the lead. Yeah, on the a, last one. On, on a half, no, it was a, no, maybe was a 30 foot three pointer there. By number 12. Yeah, I think one of the areas, uh, you know, I don't want the Columbus to kind of, mm -hmm. to start heating up from threes. You know? Yeah. So, so foul on number four, Carter and Reina Martinez will be on the line here. I think for the Javelinas, you know, I'm going to hit this drum until, you know, we got to hit our free throws, yes. especially when we win this game. Yes. Uh-oh, there it is. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. So Reina hits the first shot, and and really, Robert, our free throws have been keeping us in the game here. I think so, too, in early in this game. Oh. He just rolled out. Uh-oh, line violation, I think. Number four, Reina. So, so Reina will get another shot. All right, there you go. So another opportunity here. So it's a tight ball game right now. Good position there. Yeah. Try oh, Huerta <laughs> makes the <laughs> best there. <laughs> Without hesitation. Yeah, that's an unorthodox shot, but it, it, it it's an easy shot for her. As she, it's not the first time she takes that shot, Robert. Oh, oh, tough shot, fade away. Yes. Double team. Yeah. Carter. Good defense, but better offense in that position. Mm. Mm. Where to get some ball, good things happen. Right. Alvarado is, is, is the energy bug there. Oh, they're coming a yeah, clean probably. block. Yeah, I think that was the right call, even though I didn't like it, though, but I think it's the right call. So tight ball game now, early in the second quarter. Number 12 lines it up and splashes it. You, you know, is that what happens there? Everybody collapsed the paint. It was wide open there in that one. And that's part of their formula for the for the Cardinals. Yeah, Get to the big man, let everybody collapse, push it out to the open. Yeah, Mathis and Tribe, you know, that's their, their game. Oh, <laughs> Travel. I don't know. Yeah, it looks I, like. I, I think he didn't know what to call. Cause yeah, she, she was pushed, but. but she, didn't, she didn't move her. She tried not to lose her pivot foot, but she got her on the knee. and. So, so it looks he, like. He just called a travel. This is Columbus' biggest lead of the game. Yeah. Good block from behind. Yes. Ah, oh, too hot. Yeah. Martinez did not did not put it on her. And we saw that on Tuesday, right? Uh, I saw a lot of better passing uh -huh. Tuesday, Robert. I just felt like the receiving portion, mm -hmm. you know, a lot of, well, they couldn't control the, the pass, but she loses no. the ball. Number five recovers. Uh, the ball. Yeah. Number four goes over the back there. And so 
And also great job there on the, the varsity boys who were victorious in the last game on Tuesday, Valentine's Day. Yes. And so we're going to wait their opponent. I don't know if they're going to play this Friday. Oh, no. Probably Monday, Tuesday, right, Bobby? Next week? I heard Monday, but I'm awaiting the coach to let us know. Oh, that's a nice shot by Rios there mm -hmm. from the elbow. And contested. We're going to need a big game in Rios and Huerta. Yeah. Especially with Moscas on the bench. She loses the ball. Jump ball. So it will be Clear City ball. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about? Yes. It kind of feels weird playing on a Thursday. To me, it feels like today's Friday. Oh. <laughs> feels weird. Yeah. <laughs> Miscommunication there between Martinez and Huerta. Huerta cut in, and Martinez was trying to hit her in the corner. So one point lead here for the Cardinals. And Chrissy goes on a on a press here, man to man. Yeah. And, and it continued to go. Looks like that, yeah, the ball got poked out. Yeah. Those are one of the things that even the Cardinals struggle. I guess um, to me, Robert, Opson should have just taken the layup, but I think they're, they're programmed sometimes to feed the post, and we're taking away that option, and that is super smart for the Lady Havelinas to do. And they're going on a... Oh, he was wide open there. Oh, he was short there. Great rebound there, Havelina. A lot oh. of contact. Yes. There it is. Late whistle, but it was the right call. Yes. So Martinez should get herself on the line. Yeah. And sometimes it's not, it's not size, it's really hustle, right? You know, it doesn't matter, you're among trees in a sense. Right, but you just gotta put it inside the, the basket. Ah. Oh. And I like that light, though. See right? it behind the backboard? Yeah, kind of feels like it. NBA. Yeah, it lit up. Uh huh. Second shot is good. So Tied ball game. Tied ball game, 17 17 here. So Flores comes in, number one for Chris City. Flores, number 23. Rios, Alvarado, and Reina Martinez. Good shot there. Great job there. Uh and it was a hard shot too. Kind of like a little hook shot, fading away. It was a, it was a nice. Oh, just got a breaking news, Robert. Oh. Breaking news. Tell me. Boys' game will be in Pearsall Thursday against Carn City. This just in hot press right when? now. When? Uh, Tuesday. Thursday. Thur Thursday. Oh, no, Tuesday. No, Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah, I just found out my my vision's still not good. <laughs> so, so it's Pearsall. Tuesday against Carn City. What was it? Double they dribble? Called, they called double dribble on Ana Alvarado. So Ruiz coming in for Chris City, number 11. So on the floor we have Flores, number 23, Martinez. Good pass there. Yeah. So it is Tuesday, Robert, my breaking news updater. I guess he's listening to us. No, no. Out of so, the press. Yes. Good steal there. Fast break opportunity there. Hey, hey. Lots of dribble. Oh. And then not great. I'm just getting the ball. Was that a foul? Yes. I would say, oh, no. Hopefully it's not a jump ball there. But Zero. it is a foul. So, so far, the Colonel is the biggest lead of the game so far. Out by three. Excuse me, five. Mm -hmm. Time out, Crystal City, Robert. Okay, let's take a time out also, Bobby. Stay with us, I'll get for two.
Okay, yeah, by we're back. Uh. Okay, we're back here to the action. Yes. Lord is now having the ball now. Oh, she's looking for a reason. Mishandle that possession there. Good defense there in the Cardinals on number five. Yeah, there. Good ball handling mm -hmm. there by Martinez. So, what, so we're still not in the bonus. We're we should be in the bonus. We're close. It says yeah. seven there. So we need three more fouls. Oh, they we're they're in the bonus. Are they? Yeah, we have seven fouls and they have six fouls. So the next foul here. Oh, I see. I see. Oh. If you're right. Oh, yes, good job there. Yeah, Bosquez wanted a, a foul called. Oh, well, they called it a clean block. We have this rail in front of me, Robert, so I have him to go up and down. I know, this is real. It's bothering me also. So Bosquez have to be careful not to get the third right. foul here. Definitely we need some uh, in and out there to be crystal ball. Yes. And it seems that all the shots have been contested. So great solid defense there. Yes, Crystal the playing great defense. Mm -hmm. Cardinals playing good defense. So overall, great matchup so far, Robert. Mm -hmm. But I, I'm sure Columbus is, is not happy that Crystal City is giving them a good game here. That's not, though. This is for sure, you know, it's anybody's game here. We just got to play our game. Eliminate those uh, simple mistakes. Because Columbus, they're not going to give away this game. You, you got to go right. snatch it. What are they calling now? I think the ball went out of bounds. Should be Cardinal ball there. Oh, number 12 lines it up. And a, and a rare miss for number 12. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's been on target. Yeah. Oh. Time out, Columbus, Robert. If she would have gotten up, there wouldn't be the uh, traveling, right? If no, no. If she, she kept dribbling. Oh, okay. So as long as you keep dribbling, you, you know, and that's the trick. Whenever you hit the floor, you need to maintain a dribble to mm -hmm. be able to get up. Now, if you pick up the dribble, there's, you know, anybody who stands up, it's a travel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, at, least, at least that's what I hear about from the refs. No, no, no. That, that sounds about right, though. So, so, so far, great game, Robert. I, I'm, I'm really impressed. Well, I by think so too. Havelinas Me here. too, and you too, because cause being an underdog, you stay, you, you, you want to be within reach, and right. this is exactly what it is. You don't want to be down by ten or fifteen, so definitely you have to be within striking distance um, for the Havelinas to make their move. Yeah, and talking to the coach, he has, you know, his three key players is zero, twelve, and five. The rest are role players, but um. It says number 12 is, is uh, the ball handler and three-point threat for, for Columbus. Oh, looks like a three-second violation there. Mm -hmm. It's a minute 53 left here. Low-scoring game. A foul. I mean, a foul. Yeah, block. block. But at this pace, I would say this favors Crystal. Yes, right, right, right now. Mm -hmm. At this pace, uh -huh. yeah. So, so they called it a tie ball. So mm -hmm. it will be Cardinals ball. Next possession, next tie up will be Chris City. So, the, oh, good mo ball movement there. And they did not see number two coming around. Yeah, and got easy, easy basket. Yeah, great move without the ball there. Yeah, Oli Olivares needs to hit start hitting those threes there. Mm. 
A lot of contact, though. What, jump ball, really? Wow. Uh, That's a quick whistle there. Yeah. I want, I want Bosques to have more confidence going up. I think she's playing smart and avoiding contact. But I, I want her just to go up. And there you go, just like that. Baby. Ooh, ooh. You saw that little yes, bump? That was beautiful. That's exactly what you need. Right there. Yeah. And that's what, you, you know, that shows that, you know, that's going to make her confidence go up and mm -hmm. knowing that she can play, Rob. So. Great defense here. Yeah, Alvarado. And <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you just gotta love that, Robert. That was beautiful, coast oh. to coast. Stole the ball. The defender next to it in the hip pocket. Yes. Take it strong to the basket. I love it. Mm. Oh, that's a good defense there. I thought it was gonna be a foul there, but 22 oh, seconds Reina. left. Down by three here. Yeah, Reina with a bad pass. I think she was leading her to the to the layup. I was hoping she'd put it right in her chest so she can get an extra pass. Mm -hmm. Oh well. That's a lazy pass here, but able to yeah. get it here. I was hoping. Number twelve. Yes. Oh. Almost any jump there. Yeah, that's a volleyball move right there. <laughs> the volleyball move. Yeah, you true. called it, it's true. Yeah, she's so swung look, on look, it. Look look oh again uh, another turnover. Oh, let me see here. Yeah. One point six seconds here. Oh yeah. Time so. out, coach. Draw play up. Let's see. It's minimal. You're right, though. Maybe call a timeout here. You, you can't carry over timeouts, can you? Take it. Oh. Too strong. But at least they made an attempt. So down by three. Half time, Robert. Good game so far. Cardinals 24 over your mighty Holiness 21. We got a 10 minute break here. Let me run some. Um, commercials real quick and uh any last words bobby oh no just keep it here uh -huh. and the other guy's sports show with it it's anybody's game Robert. it is anybody's hey, hey, game yeah, I'm, it is. I'm excited so at this pace this is favors crystal but we need to take the lead in early in the third quarter and that's where we got to make your move so anyways yes uh stay with us see the great game in the second half and stay with us i guess sports show you've got a hefty truck loan weighing you down, you can lighten the load at your local credit union. Our auto rates are hard to beat. Apply online today. We belong to you. Border Federal Credit Union, serving the community since 1954. Stop by, give us a call, or visit us online at borderfcu.com. Insured by NCUA.
Okay, guys, we're back live here in the start of the third quarter. And uh, a special guest here, we got Coach Battle. Th thank you, Coach Battle, for joining us in our broadcast here with the other guys' sports show. Alvarado yeah. lines it up. Ah. So one question that I have for sure, we do have. You've got to be happy with this rebounding effort here, Robert. Coach, yeah, I agree. They got they got a she's about a six foot, six foot two. Uh, she's been giving us troubles in the middle. They've been sitting, sitting here in the middle of the zone and just kind of just putting their big hands up and just kind of deflecting a lot of shots. Get in there, Martinez. Yes. Oh, that's that's sit in. We needed that one. We do, uh huh. And I was talking about that. I think the three point game is going to be a big factor in this game, you know, too. Yeah, to number, open 12, up the lanes. number 12 hit some early, that half court shot, and then another couple open ones. Yeah, uh, talking earlier to their coach, number 12. Five and zero is basically their key players on on their on their game. Close out. So, and sometimes, you know, the girls having to feed that tall girl has been working against them since we've been, you know, denying that the girl had an easy layup but decided to pass it and and you know, so that's working in our favor. Good job by our coaching staff there, coach, coach Battle. Thank you for joining us here in the other guys' sports show. I I couldn't hear you earlier. I can hear you now though. <laughs> I don't know if it's our wiring or just. I think I'm using one of the oldest headsets we had, Robert. Where uh, I think so too. It, it's been battle tested. Oh, mm -hmm. get in there, get in there. Rebound, let's go jump off. Oh, Ivana Flores, there saying, "I will That's not be denied." Foul. Oh, wow, triple team. Yeah, no, Ivana. Ivana's the she's real deal. Yeah, she's special. I, I, I called it earlier. I think she's the most improved basketball player this year. She's. Yeah, they they had a few of. Them. Start off kind of slow. I talked to Relila earlier this this yeah. week. I said, "Hey, you improved from game one uh. to playoff one. She's been improving every week. Yes, with, with her rebounding and her offensive rebounds. Yeah, and, 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 and like we that. can say that, but most of the girls yeah. here, yeah, it's you know, get in there, buddy. And and that's our, our first lead here, Robert, in the second half. And we're going back to the press here. Yeah, and in front of her. Yeah, number 12 is the a key girl to watch. And Alvarado just being that the ladybug. That's what they've been doing. For Christy. Oh, oh, yeah. That's, that's and, good. and that's, that's their good. game plan right there. And, of course, um, Tribe doing the, the correct thing, sealing her down. Well, she's in a tough spot. She's fronting. And as soon as she comes yeah. up and gets past her defender, she comes up, they're going to just dump it off every time. Yes. Over the top. That's a tough. Mm hmm there we go. Good nice. Oh, strong to the basket. I like that. Huerta. Uh, Rochelle's been playing good, too. And we're going to need her to, to see if we can Get pull there. up this win. Oh. Flores gets there the rebound. Goes. Coast to coast. Yeah, she, she's got to lay up if she wants it. She's have to be cool and collected. She'll go up. Get in there. Yes. Good. Nice That's a timeout, time out, coach. Time out. So, Robert. We, let's stay here. Let's stay here. Let me fix the camera here. Yeah. Coach, a serious question. Now, we're going to get a gym like this in Crystal. Yes, it's it's in the works. <laughs> oh. It's in the works. Um, but we got to think of one project at a time. <laughs> I know this is uh, – I got here and think, wow, this is a nice gym. Yeah, this is a nice gym. Uh -huh. I've, I've only can, played on You can go to this camera here. Right? Let's go here. Okay, we're right here and this camera over here. Yeah. Uh, Wait, well, you look skinnier now, Coach. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, I'm, well, I was worried about the but especially the between, camera. between us, <laughs> yeah. right? Exactly. The camera adding an extra 15 pounds. Yeah, I was, it, I was it started about with it. 30 pounds and then just <laughs> five pounds is what I'm seeing right now. You look extra skinnier right now, Coach. <laughs> Thanks. I hardly so. ever get that. <laughs> well, you can get that with the other guys' porch show anytime. So, yeah, it will, this gym, you know, they talked about it was built back in 1966, and they've been major updates, but. At the most part, it's an old gym, but Chris City will, will benefit from a good facilities is basically what we want, right? And hopefully, within time, mm. it, the community can get a, get behind that because when you have facilities to build on, you know, it's a, a bad lot, pass. Yes, a lot of people want us to do miracles with very little. Oh, great defense there by Alvarado, but oh, wow. better offense she's than Robert. Three, yeah, she's three for four tonight. She's yeah. only missed one shot. Yeah, she's on point. You know, definitely you have to keep an eye on her. And, and so like, they take the lead back. And like that, yeah. I wouldn't say that. They got the lead back. I know you guys got your 55 rule, but there's a whoever wins the third quarter is another 80% 
Stat for you guys. Yeah, we're bringing. I like that. I like that. I like that. Huh? This is a good yeah, one. We've been using that MIT, you know, yeah. analytics there. Uh, Harvard. Where, where you can't go wrong with MIT, guys. Yeah. You can't go wrong with MIT. Where it gets to 55 first. Out. Shot. Mm. Rochelle. Mm. Good pump. Yes. That oh. she go up, I mean, bring it up, bring it up. There you go. There yeah. it is. Mani. And and Boskis, she's no, great she's, there on the yeah, basket. She, yeah, she is. I know she started with some early foul trouble. Um, yeah. Got two quick ones early. Mm. Yeah, but Boskis missed consistency. You know, she's consistently doing really good. Got to come up on that Boskis. You can't sit in the paint on oh, that. All by herself. Oh, got blocked. That's her man setting the screen. She got to come up on that. Yeah. A lot oh. of collision there. Good job, Ray. Look up. Uh, there you go. Take your time. Yes, take, take your time. time. Diggity, diggity. Good. Good. Money. Find your man. Yeah, back and forth they go. Now it is up by two now. Yeah, we're still in the press. Ah, that's a double. Uh, double dribble. There we go. There we go. Coach, let me ask you another yeah. question. Yes, who's, sir. Who's your favorite NBA team? NBA team. And don't say the Lakers. Well, if you look at my family history, <laughs> we're split. Oh, really? <laughs> Lakers and Spurs. Okay. Um, um, so, okay then, then so, who's your favorite team? I was a Lake. I'm a Lakers fan. Oh, and, and oh no. You just, you and just then went I up the whole. <laughs> now you're in a higher level now. I lived in San Antonio for 15 years, and the water cooler talk was easier when you talk Spurs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm, Especially during that rain where they're yeah, raced for Sace. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, well. And then Kobe went down, and we're. Yeah. It's been a long time since 2009. Oh. 2020, of course. Yes, 2020. I also love my Spurs, but they've been struggling in the last few years, and it's hard to watch them, but, you know. Well, my house is, is, is split the same way, Coach. So I, I married a Spurs fan, and she's a diehard. But I've enjoyed both championships between the Lakers and the Spurs, and, you know, and I love Coach Pop and the Spurs organization. So That's a travel. It, oh, they called it, yeah. That was a travel. It was, uh-huh. It uh, was a late call, but it was the right call, though. No, no, no. She, she had a passport and everything. Dude. She was going <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> I think she forgot her bags. Yeah. So. Yeah, same way. My wife's a diehard Spurs fan. Um, it's a split house. We'll see what my son does. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, I'm, oh, my kids. Are, I got two Laker fans and one Spurs fan. Oh, my gosh. My, of my three kids. Bad pass there. And Robert, right now is 100% advantage Crystal City because not only are we putting a a serious lock on the, on their team, they they're worried. So this has got to be Crystal just got to keep their foot on the pedal and just keep going. Well, of course, because if you're favorite to win, you know there's added pressure. Wow, Boskis. Yeah. yeah. Oh, good rebound there by Alvarado. Sure pass, uh, that's a good block there. And going go. back a few plays ago, uh, Boskis got hammered there. There was no, no call there, so I'm surprised that was a few plays ago. Uh, They're letting him play good. for the most part. Yes. I, I, that good pump. I That's oh, they call it trial. I saw I put that. the ball down first. Mm, I saw that. It's a tough one. I don't like it, but it's the right call, I guess. Yes. <laughs> Is her left foot? I saw that, huh? Yeah. I'm asking another question, Coach. You yes. you're good with numbers. What do you think, what's your best guess capacity of this gymnasium? Best guess uh -huh. capacity. I'm going to look up. It goes down. And oh, that's easy. Let's see. 853. What do you mean, 853? 853 in the seats. And then in the back, we got about another 200, so about. I'm, I'm talking about the whole gym. Oh, the whole gym. Okay. The whole gym. You, uh -huh. Oh, I thought you meant one side. No, no, the whole gym. So, oh. so with the math, that, that's at 1700 yeah, or 1650. 1650. But the lady earlier, I said a thousand. I said five thousand. Robert said five thousand, and the Good the job. lady from here, she says that capacity is at five thousand. Wow. So I was like, I don't see it. <laughs> I see it. <laughs> you know. Take it up. That's a foul. Oh, oh no call. You're right. Great. Contact. Move on. The Cardinals are up by one now with two minutes and nine seconds left. Hey, shout out to the baseball team. I know you guys are watching back at home. Right. Coach Long must have got the boys watching at home and everybody else. Thank you for watching. You know, the boys are going to play, what was it, Tuesday? Tuesday. Uh -huh. Yeah. 
I got a text saying that they playing Tuesday in Pearsall against Carn City. Mm -hmm. That's so, true. so tune in to the other guy's sports show and hopefully we can get Coach Battle there again. He's gonna be our good luck charm here. If we win, the, if we win this one, I might have to. Yes. <laughs> Behind you. Good get shot. in there. Nice. Mm. I like the mm -hmm. angle, but the rail really gets in the way, right? Yeah, a little bit, right? It does. Mm -hmm. Don't stop. Mm. Oh, come on, let's go, let's go. It? Good. It's a foul count. Yeah, number 12. Howlin's out by one here. I was telling baby, uh, I was telling uh, Bobby, this is the pace I think favors Crystal. You know, low scoring game, kind of a grind it out type of game. Yeah, I mean, to me, right now, the Lily Havanese are outperforming my expectations. So, kudos to them. Yeah, I know I talked to him before the game, just kind of mm. the rides of basketball. It goes mm -hmm. high and it goes low. Don't mm -hmm. get too high on the mm -hmm. highs. Mm -hmm. Don't get too low on the lows. Good pass. Oh, beautiful. Where's a foul at? And one. And one. Good job. Good pass. That's what I'm talking about. Good pass. And I like Bolski. I like the way she uses her body. Just kind of a little bump. That's all you need right there. That's, that's pretty much all you need. Mm -hmm. She's playing very well. Now finish it with the free throw. Good shot. Oh. No good. So, short. Mm -hmm. so down, up Get three back. now. Don't foul. Somebody's leaving yeah. their man open. Mm -hmm. Looks like Ivana was lost. Yes. Crystal ball. And if they're in man, you can't, you, that's the thing about it, you can't lose your man on it. And right. That, and, and, and a lot of times, you know, there's a rule to me is that two, if it, you're two passes away, you can cheat, but you got to be aware with that, you know, your man's at at all times. See man, see ball. Exactly. All see the time. See man, see ball. You know, that's a, a fundamental deal that I try to preach to kids. You got to see the man, your man, and the ball because you don't want to be blinded. Let's bring it over here to the camera. All right, Robert. So, golly, Coach, I'm excited today. I mean, this is. <laughs> it feels weird. It's a Thursday. I wish we would have played Friday. It feels to me like tomorrow's Saturday. So I'm, my, it's just, I'm out of whack. Sorry. Yeah, and I think I've heard a few kids say uh -huh. that. Hey, it feels like a Friday. Uh -huh. no? Today's Thursday. Yeah, guys. I know, right? But well, if they keep if they keep winning the way they're supposed to, the state championship game would be on a Thursday for. Them. You know oh, what I'm okay. So, so we're gonna try to get used to it. I like you gotta that. get used to Thursdays. I, I like what we're doing. You gotta, oh, you like gotta get used to Thursdays. Uh -huh. um, and that, mm. that's probably the reason behind it, for sure. <laughs> So 50.8 here in the third period. God dang oh, it. It was a lazy pass. Got no, oh, tight ball. Really no call. Oh, really? <laughs> but it's a fall called on number, there number one. So she'll be, no. No, nah, she's going up. Mm -hmm. So it'll be shooting two here. Just keep an eye on number 12. Oh, wow, two shots. Yeah, two shots. Oh, wow, she was going I, up. I didn't see that. Yeah, I thought it was on the floor. Me but too. Nice bucket. She's a left-handed number zero, and she's a senior, and, you know, she's the ball handler and the leader of that team. Yeah, she seems mm -hmm. more passive to me, but mm -hmm. she knows she's kind of the general of that team. Right. Um, she's looking for big number five, uh, looking for number 12, and just kind of just playing her role. Mm. I'm inside by one here. Oh, wow. Gave it to her. Yeah, so, so Reese will find herself on the line now, and we need to connect on those two po baskets here because we don't want to go into the fourth down because now they're going to be playing for the last shot. Was Coach Battles, what was, it, what, was your, what was your analytics on the third period? Uh, you win the third quarter 85%. <laughs> it went up. It went up. It went up. You, and you. It, it went up because we were already winning the third quarter. <laughs> <laughs> we already won the third quarter. We're down by three and a half. Tie ball. Tie ball. That's ours. Yeah, we're we're down by three. So yeah, we're up by one we'll now with thirty-eight point nine seconds on the clock. That's Boskis. Good shot. Mm. Oh, Man, too hard. Thirty-five seconds. Can't she see. saved it. Get up and get back. Yeah, number somebody five, gotta stay up on five, twelve. Number five, number five. Good job, everyone. Number three is open. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, nice. Good elbow shot, but we didn't get nothing here. Pass it. Seventeen <laughs> seconds. 
Pass the ball. Come on, give up the ball. Good pass. Oh, no call. Seven seconds. We got it. Oh. Mm. You got to stay on them. Stay on them. Three, Three seconds. Two. One. Another freaking oh, that, that, buzzer. That's the, that's the one you want shooting. That's oh. not the one. And the lady having his. Was a one point lead heading to the fourth. When's the third quarter? Final period. Yeah, right. When's the third quarter? To me, they're, they're 26 or 16 points away from sealing it and letting the gods. Oh, I don't know. Get it, I don't know they're going to reach 55 at, at, at this pace. We're going to find out. You well, think they will? You, well, you got to aim for it, Robert. <laughs> if, if you want is the that, gods. Is that eight again. baskets? <laughs> That's 40. Yeah, 16. Maybe. 16. Maybe. It depends. You know. I mean, it's simple. Coach, let me ask you, let me question. What do you think about the upcoming baseball season and softball season kind of coming up? Or mm -hmm. um, we're excited. I'm excited for them. I know the baseball team is very excited. I know. Our I know last year they made the playoffs, though. You know that, that was nice to see. Made the playoffs and they won a playoff game. Uh -huh. So I'm looking forward to them getting to the regional tournament. I told uh -huh. Coach Lemus that the other day. Yeah. Uh -huh. Don't come back to the office without a regional tournament under that belt. Under the belt. Wow. No, and I. You, you heard. You heard here first. Yes, <laughs> and, and he has a talent. I mean, to me, Coach, I, I'm. Excited for next year already as well. I've heard good things. You know, you, you have some good administration behind you. Yes, you know, I, do. That's I, true. I, I was talking to one of them, and, and he was talking about how his prediction was, and he had you in this little pedestal there. And I'm like, simmer down. You know, I, don't, I haven't seen battle no, too much. And he, he was like, no, no, I see the kids. I've been, so I've been, of course, I was playing devil's advocate, right? Like, God's come too. on. And, and so I was impressed. I, I was surprised to hear all that positivity, and but you just gotta love it, right? As a fan, I love it. And you said mm -hmm. it right the first time. Kudos to our administration for allowing yeah. me mm -hmm. to work with the kids the way I have been so far. And yeah. The, and the kids been for the most part putting in the work. I've heard a lot of our kids just saying, "I can't wait, I can't wait." Yeah. I said, "We gotta enjoy the grind. You can't fast forward to August." Right. The, the <laughs> so. grind's everything. Number five on the line. That's Ali Tribe again. Yeah, I don't know about that personal foul. It was it was good defense, but you know, it is what it is. Mm -hmm. Tie ball game here for the lead. Nice bucket there, and Fair she looks person. exhausted. So we gotta keep it up. Middle. Oh, Rochelle, not trusting getting it back to. <laughs> that was close. Yeah. Somebody's Man. open. Yeah. Put your head up. Go, Rochelle. You're not even running. Yeah. Uh, no travel call. Really? She kept her dribble. Good block. Oh, All right, here we go. go. Take your time. Take your time. Fowler. And one. No, no call. Good basket, though. Yeah, it was. Got a sprint. I think about basketball, you got to sprint to spots. I know when you're pressing. Right. There you go. Good defense. Well, this is how they do it. Don't. Good shot. So 43-40 there, and, and it all coming with this little press here. And, and uh, my, my golden rule is if they turn your back, there you, go. you uh -huh. can pick their pocket there. Uh, that was a mistake. Pick up the dribble there. Yeah, it was. Mm -hmm. She's probably very upset at herself. Yeah, you could clearly she was upset. Uh -huh. So far, I think if the Hornets going to pull out this win, you know, it's going to start in defense. Yes, sir. Yes. Oh, that's a foul. Oh, push there. No call. <laughs> yeah, they called it. Well, she sold they called it. it. Oh, I thought it was She scared. sold it, or they really pushed her? <laughs> no, I think they really pushed her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to agree. They, they pushed on that. <laughs> they did. We can't be too biased. Yeah. Okay, no, no, we, I there you go. Go get that, Rochelle. Oh. We're always waiting. From the elbows. Yeah, sometimes we, we want to be the Sean Elliott. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, of Fox Sports here. And I usually watch the Spurs with, on, on mute, guys. Yeah. Because <laughs> of Sean Elliott. Sean Elliott just can't be so biased, right? And yeah. But Pass it. But we find ourselves broadcasting in a soft oh. shot. That's tough. No angles for a backboard. It is. You're right, though. Behind I think you. it was behind the backboard, yeah, right? Yeah, was behind uh -huh. the backboard. No angle for it. Mm -hmm. Foul on number 23. Her third foul. So she can stay aggressive here. Mm. Trying to look for number five. Good job there, by the way. And that's the that's you know she's okay. going in at the right time. Wow. Well, yeah. mm. Almost had a turnover there, but able to regroup there. Mm. Pass it. 
Oh, no yeah. call. Yeah, tough shot. That's a tough shot. Mm -hmm. Fast oh, break she's gonna line it up. Oh. God dang it. Travel. Travel. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Needed that one. Yeah, yes. I think she, she was hesitated there a little bit, she right? She was excited. Uh -huh. That's yeah. what it was. Maybe got two. happy feet. Yeah, yeah, that's true. She got happy feet. She got excited, wide open. And it happens, you know. And I was, we were talking to the coach here that uh, Columbus, they're really more like a volleyball team. Really? Uh -huh. yeah, they're yeah. real good at volleyball. Yeah, they went to the semifinals last Push year. Push off, oh. really? I didn't see an extension. Yeah, I mean, either. I know it's like a little chicken wing there, but I don't know if it's enough to call it. Yeah, though. you usually got to see a full extension. Mm -hmm. I agree. Seems like they're trying to get tightened up a little bit towards the end of this fourth quarter. Bobby, who's the one going to UTC for Columbus? Uh, number five. Number five? Number really? Five. Yeah, she's going on a volleyball scholarship. The coach says that she's good enough to play basketball over there as well. So She traveled too. Yeah, yep. a little hop before that. She should be doing that. Mm. Pass it. Oh. Behind you. Crystal really a volleyball here. scholarship. That's yes. good for her. Yes, and, and and you're happy for all our small districts or anybody who can make it to the next level. You, you're excited. Yeah, I was excited to see both in the state championship game this year. Yes. Could help. There she is. Out. Swing. Oh, good job. Ooh. Ours out of bounds. Flores we gets it. We got it. Yeah. Pass it. Oh, she, I was hoping for the backboard. Me too. It was a lot of contact. Steal. Oh, it's steal. Bring it down hard. Oh. In and out. And he, everything but the ring. Mm -hmm. We got one back there. Yes. Force the pass. Hands. No. Oh, ref. You saw that mm -hmm. far away. Let number three. So, so Bailey uh, Gustus will be shooting two uh, with an opportunity to take the lead. So great defense on both sides, coach. And Lady Havelinas have, you know. And right now in the free throws, you know, they're killing us here. In, uh, the, uh, the Cardinals here in the free throws. Yeah, and that's what we're about close games. Mm -hmm. It's going to come down the free throw line at some point yeah. in time. Right now, the, the foul is eight fouls for Chris City, four on the Cardinals on this start of the fourth timeout, Crystal City. Full timeout, Robert, so bring it here. Okay, let's bring it over here. Back over here. So, very exciting ball game here. Keep it here with the other guys' sports show. We have Coach Battle on the booth here. And on, on the hot seat. On the hot <laughs> seat. <laughs> he's, he's I, I, feel, I feel the fire. Right? <laughs> yeah. I feel the fire. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that one of the admissions, you know what, you want to know what his prediction was for next year of football? I want to hear it. 8-2. Oof. <laughs> That's similar to mine. <laughs> oh! 10 and 0. Oh, hey. Too, too, I, me, I, too early for a prediction for too me. Too early. Too, too early. Too early for me. I, I can't I, wait to hear your prediction. I, I, I cannot <laughs> wait because I'm tuned in for that day. I remember back in 92 where coaches would, would hand us out, what, how do you feel you can do this year? I was the only football player that put 10 and 0. <laughs> And I'm you like, gotta believe. I'm like, how in the heck can you think you're gonna just win three games? Like some of my my co <laughs> my teammates, I'm like, I was so disappointed <laughs> through that locker room, man. So and how I'm many like, did y'all win? Three. <laughs> 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 hey, it was awesome though. Hey, at the end of the day, I, I love my teammates, my classmates, and but uh, it's a brotherhood. Yeah, they were my ride and die. But I mean, man, back, back to the action. And, and that's one of the things, Coach, like this, you know, outgoing seniors, you, you want them to be still part of the program as far as the coulda, shoulda, woulda conversations start after you finish. And they need to be able to tell that story to like, un upcoming freshmen. Cause yeah, and I know one of the things I did uh, for our last game, I let the seniors come up on stage and kind of tell them basically mm -hmm. what you said. Yeah. What could you have done better? What could you have changed? Or what, do you, what did you enjoy from this season? My two, three, yes, two, three things I asked them. And a lot of them were like, I wish I would have done more. Yeah. And and that's what I hate hearing from athletes after the season. Right. Oh, number one. Oh, rims. Good rebound. Good rebound there. Put back, put back. Oh, Martinez he had it. That one. There's a foul on that. Yes. Yes, you're right. That's a good one. It was a foul. Yeah. No, and 
And this group has a good senior class there. Oh, Flores is talking about Pass seniors. It. She traveled. Travel, yeah. It, it was a travel. You got up from the floor. Yeah. So at this point, is anybody's game here? Yeah, she should have called a timeout. <laughs> I don't think we have, what, two more or one more? Two timeouts left. Oh. Looking for five again. That's all mm. she's doing. She's getting past her defender and then looking for number five over the and, top. And that's their game plan. And earlier, she, you know, number five was being fronted, so the pass couldn't come in. And that's why we got to be strategic to where you got to know where the ball is. So you you got to be facing the ball at all times. Mm. You know, if they if want to pass it through you, let her jump and get it and then try to go over you. Yes, sir. You know, that's what we're talking about, earning your baskets. Number five ties it up. Miss Tribe. So Flores and Bosquez down for rebounds. Reese, Flores, top of the key, and Alvarado on the floor for Chris City. Three minutes and 44 seconds here. Lots of time, lots to, of time. To, to go get, and get this area championship she going. Oh. That extra stop. Uh, really? She, she moved her pivot foot? Pivot foot? I, I'm, I think she's scared because I could hear, I have heard of a skid. I don't know if that's what the ref went with, but he went off his ears on that yeah. one. Yeah. So Holland down mm -hmm. by one here. 329 left. There it is. She came up too. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. They're trying. Good defense at number 12 though. Don't get a, a foul. Uh. Against Crystal? No, no against them. Okay. Number zero. How many fouls does she have? That will be her four, fourth penalty. Four. Yeah, that's her fourth foul. And I don't think they have another ball handler. Maybe number twelve, Bosquez. She tried oh. again. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be a call. <laughs> She's trying. Man. Oh, man. <laughs> On the floor, Tied. jump ball. Jump bars. That's our ball. <laughs> I mean, you just got to love the effort on both teams here, Columbus and Crystal City. Crystal City needs to just keep grinding here. Good shot. Get in there. Get in there. Roll in there. <laughs> yes. Big three points away. Yes. Good, so good, good one point game. Over the top. Turn around. And then all they doing she is... She traveled, too. Yeah, yeah. That's a good defense there. Coast to coast. Yeah. Where's the... Nothing? Mm. Oh, we got it. There we go. You got it? Yes. Yeah, we got it. Now we got to... Got it. Yeah, we got to finish strong here. Throws. Take advantage of them. So number five. Coach, and that's ask, her fourth foul now. Let me ask you a question. Have you gone to the state championship here in the basketball in the Alabama Dome? Yeah, I went to it as a coach. Oh, <laughs> really? Yeah, wow. I, was at, I was at Wagner. Um, How was the experience? Oh. We played. It was. It was amazing. I could imagine. We lost. But it was wow, amazing. that's tough. Yeah, we lost, mm. but it was amazing. I was being by. We were talking about. We should go. We should know. go as uh -huh. spectators. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's great basketball at that level, all the way around. We missed both free throws, so we just maintain a one-point lead here. Alvarado needs to stay with number 12 here. Yeah, we've got to lock down number 12. Yeah. Trying there you go, there you go. Good. Oh, push. Uh, that's her fourth foul? Yeah, that will be her fourth here. Let me. Oh, her third foul. A third, okay. So she can one. stay. I don't think she's missed a free throw yet. I'm trying to nah. get the jinx. You're right. Uh -huh. She hasn't but missed one yet. She's been solid. But number five has four fouls. Oh, three fouls. Number zero has four it fouls. Worked. There oh, it is. Great. There, there it is. Go, she's been, yeah, the jinx is in. Thank you, coach. <laughs> now, you and Robert both qualify for the jinxsters. <laughs> Robert's done that. I did that a couple times already. <laughs> <laughs> back to back, maybe? It's very rare. There we go. <laughs> oh, my God. It Love worked. It worked. Love it. Off her foot. There you go. Her. Give Crystal ball. Crystal ball. No. Off her foot. Oh, come on, coach. <laughs> oh. Oh, two minutes and 19 so seconds left. Somebody's lost. You got one wide open. Mm. Mm. 
Looking for five. Mm -hmm. Oh, she kept it herself. Kept it herself. Come on, we need rebound. Let's go, Huduko. Over the back. Oh, oh wow. That's a lot of foul there. You're right over the back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Travel. Oh, travel. Travel. Three seconds. Oh. I'll, take, I'll take that one, too. Yeah, you're right, though. The, the, she was there a long time. Yeah, she had a campfire going. <laughs> I saw some s'mores. <laughs> So two minutes, guys. Two minutes. Man, I don't oh. think I can sit down here. Let me get up here a little bit. So two minutes, Robert, to advance and get the area championship here for the Lady Havelinas. Wow, we're one and one. Make your free throws, man. Okay, now here, now here. This is where. Yeah, that's what I meant. You're gonna it. win or lose the game here. Well, not at this, but you know what I mean. No, yeah, the free throws <laughs> the free is throws. very important. Mm -hmm. And what's the best thing about them is they're free. Mm -hmm. You're you gonna set it up? That, that's fine. We can take that's it off good. if you need it. One more. Oh, ice water. Let's go let's finish, finish it off here. You can take it off Hold if you need follow to. Through. Yeah. yeah. There it is. You're more rebound. Oh, rebound. Bring it back up. Good. Yes. Two for one. Don't don't reach. Stand Top front. by four. You know, yeah. get back. Sprint yeah. back. Don't uh, don't let out the gas. Yeah, that's number twelve needs to. Oh, hey, he's travel. That's yeah, good, that that was a good foul. foul. That was a good foul. It was a body foul on the floor, but they're shooting two. They're in double bonus. Number five, zero for two last time. What do you think? She can she can't miss. Not she, 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 she can can't be. not three in a row, right? <laughs> no, uh, it's unheard of. Yeah, it's very. <laughs> un, I've never seen a player miss oh, three her, in a row. Her, her legs might be tired, guys. Her legs <laughs> might be tired. Uh, you can't miss three in a row. Okay. I'll put the camera back over. Yes. There's no way. Four in a row. There's no way you can miss four in a row. No, no, it's uh, that's uncommon. <laughs> to miss a four free throw straight. Well, I think Bobby mentioned it. it. might be tired legs also. At this, well, you got really, really dig in. Yeah, oh. they're playing with, there it is. Yeah. Come up to the ball, come to the ball. Olena's not She's riding lead. her hard. Time out, coach. She called he, a timeout. He, time he gave it to us, he gave it to us. He he gave it. She he called a timeout. He gave it to us. Yeah, it looks like the fans here, they don't like and, it here. And, and Alvarado even pointed to the coach to call, get a timeout. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to say here, though. Oh, man, too, the camera. Too excited. It's okay. Uh, it's excited here. What was it? How many times left? Like less than a minute? Less than two minutes, right? Yeah, it's less than two minutes. I think I saw 136. Uh, up by three here. Uh, the Cardinals are in the <laughs> double bonus. So 149. Mm-hmm. That's yes, 149. So are we going to reach 55? That's my other yeah, situation. If we do, you know, there's just the gods just start getting in the way, Robert. And right now, you know, the Cardinal fans, you know, are acting up a storm. Well, it is. Well, one thing, number 12, you know, I don't want to say it, but I'm going to say it anyways. She's been kind of quiet in the three. Yes. I haven't, and, I haven't and, seen her attempt one. I know, I know. And I, a lot of contribution with good defense so, on the house. So a minute and 35 seconds 35. remaining here. I said 36. The Hog Nation starting to get loud. Yes, yes, Robert. How many fans are watching, Robert? Uh, let me see. We got a hundred and ninety-six. Oh wow! Thank okay. you for watching another good sports show, guys. Yeah, and Robert, you have yet to throw that cash app out there. I know. I'm gonna put it right now because so. I, I just want to tell the fans that we're in the black. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. We, and, don't and need coach, it. You know. Don't need it. You don't yeah. need it. You don't need it. Let's go. Here we go. Here we go. Kill smart, 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 smart. God dang it! Kickball. Oh, we got the ball back. Oh, they gave it to me. Who has the ball? Crystal? Yeah, yeah we crystal got the ball. Minute and 18. Be sure to do me a favor. Subscribe to the other guy's sports show. Catch it. A minute and 18 left here. Take your time. Pass. Good. Hold it. Swing it. Pass. That's a foul. Yeah, that's a foul there. No call. They're trying. Good. Yeah. So they found foul Reese there and put her on the line. And Reese is a great free throw shooter. Let's, let's see. 
we not we need one. Yeah, oh, one for two is great, but I'm a guy that likes to get both. Oh, no, no, no. Yes, yes. Oh, You're no. greedy that way, right? Ah, I'm very greedy. <laughs> get in there, get in there. We got the rebound. Oh, oh. Almost had it there. We got it. Take your time. Oh, good job there. Good oh, rebound. 57 They're seconds lost. here. She traveled. Sorry, guys. And foul number 12. I think you would hit both shots. Now, that's number 12, fourth oh, foul. No, no, no. This is not a shooting foul, right? No, we're in one on we're in one. one, 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 one. So the next one will be shooting two. Come on, Hogs. Hog Nation. Prendeme la vela, por yeah. favor. Prendeme la vela, los crucitas. Dang it. Oh. Oh. Oh, we need that one. Yeah. There's one at 12. Yeah. Ooh, nothing. Oh, nothing. Oh, hook. Yes. We got an orange shot. Good basket. Good basket there. <laughs> God damn it. Crystal ball. 36 seconds left. Howlin is up by one now. Timeout. Timeout. Columbus. Full timeout, Robert. No, no. We're going to stay here. No, I'm too excited. Well, and, and I'll tell this to the fans, Robert. We're in the black because we, we, after that um, playoff game in and, and Rivaldi, I went to Taco Bell and I got denied. Oh. Yeah, credit. <laughs> denied. <laughs> So I was like, oh, shoot, we're there already. <laughs> we're there. But I wanted to say that a lot of it has to do because we, we made a big donation yes. and sacrifice from the other guy's sports show yes, we did. to bring something good for your athletic program, Coach. And we're really proud of that. Yeah, you we're know. excited for that day. Um, Coach Tully gets to come up and train our young offensive linemen. Yes. Um, from ages 6th grade up to 12th grade. Wow. Okay, yeah. so you, you've been in communication with them already? Yes, sir, I have. Yeah, and, and I want to thank thank Alex Martinez, one of the key guys that kept in touch with Tuli and really pressed him on trying to do it with the min most minimal money. <laughs> and stretch it, stretch so, it. so we saw what he charges others. So we're, we're paying like maybe 25%, which is, which is awesome. You know, it is pricey, but I feel that I, when I saw the prices, I, I saw what he was charging a lot more. No way, it was too soon. It was kind of quick, though. Yeah, no. Wow, 30 seconds here. Come on, this is where we need to lock down on defense here. Howling is up by one here. 30.5 seconds, exactly. Yes. So, Lady having us up. I'm looking for zero. Oh, we lost time. Yeah, good drive. Looking for, uh oh. There's five. Yes. God dang it. Yes. Yes. They moved the ball smoothly there. Ten seconds, 11 seconds. So, what happened? You have the ball now. We got the ball. He called timeout. Mm -hmm. 11 seconds here. So and they were looking for number, what was it, uh, number five there in the paint, though. Yes, she, she was camping down, and I was hoping for a three-second call, but good ball rotation there for Columbus, and it was able to find her, and it was a, you know, we could have collapsed on her, but I think it might have been an and one. So we got to take, you know, it's only a one-point game, so a, a two-pointer will win it, guys. If they so, foul us, we're shooting two anyways. Right. Uh, we're double bonus with the next foul on um, if they reach, catch the reach. So, yeah, so so Coach is out there trying to run a play there, trying to make the girls either drive or go through some screens and have an open look for an open shot. But he needs to expect a press coming up here. So breaking the press is going to be the key here. Sub in. We'll go for the home run. Yes. Plenty of time, though, for a good shot, yeah. though. That's... Got you out. Just, oh. oh, my God. That was a lazy pass. Six seconds. That's too soon for that. Mm. God. Mm. So, so, wow. so, Columbus wins on the last bucket. 51 of 50, Robert. Oh, wow. Coach. I know. It seemed that we had it there, but... It came down to the free throws, I think. 
Yes. Yes. Uh huh. So you know, it's it's a hard fought battle. You know, we, we were there to the end clearly. So, but uh, great job, Lady Havanias Robert. Oh, it's, and it hurts. It, it does hurt. You know, yes. and and we're talking about our seniors. You know, they they, you know, but they need to understand that. You know, it takes the grind to get better, and hopefully the, the seniors will pay it forward and let them know where they're at because they literally had this game. You know, they have to say we could have won, you know. But good shot on the, on the lower end. Yeah, but and the basketball gods. <laughs> no, we didn't, we didn't get to the – so the gods did not get involved at all. Hey, Bobby, you want to remove the camera? Over yeah, um, you got it. Oh, you got it. Oh, you got it? Okay. So – Man, it's tough there. You know, it is going to be a tough pillow to swallow here. But uh, yeah. but great season, though, for the Javelinas. And, it, and it's tough, though. Yeah. For the seniors, you know, you, you got to, you know, you put your heart there. And so they know that they did a heck of a job. Yeah, first and, here. Yeah, first here. and foremost, you know, I don't want them to hang their head at all. This was a, a great fought game. It, we had it, you know. You know, I think this area championship was ours. I think that's gonna way it's gonna hurt more though, you right? Know, because you know it was within their grasp, but it is you know it's tough, man. Yes, and, and it's, but I'm really proud of them. I I want to say, yeah, hey, don't hang yourself, but we need to keep fighting. You know, I I always tell my son or my kids, know that feeling and make sure you don't like that feeling because you know all, at the end of the day you just gotta work harder for the next time you get an opportunity mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to play in any level. You know, you know that's the beauty of sports. You always get another opportunity. Yes, sir. You know, so even if it's in a basketball court or in a park somewhere. Yeah, you can always <laughs> take it to Maverick Park. <laughs> park. Yeah. So with that being said, guys, um, I just want to say thanks to our community for supporting the Other Guys Sports Show. Mm -hmm. You know, we're, we are waiting on, on two of our sponsors to 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 pay us up so that way we can go back to the, you know, get. I mean, we're, we're in the red. I'm sorry. I said we're in the black. Right? Yes, yeah, so we're in the we're red. red. Uh -huh. Yeah, we're in the red. Yeah, we're back. Yeah, so yeah, we're we're already where I'm getting my card denied. <laughs> <laughs> Don't so, want that. <laughs> yeah, so I've been using my personal card for for most of the expenses now. But, but um, congratulations, Columbus Cardinals and, and Lady Havalinas on a great you know, season. They had yeah. a great season. And Coach Cardona, this is his last game. Yes. So. Coach Cardona needs to be proud of himself as well as he had an opportunity. He, he did well. He got a, got himself all the way to the area basketball championship and a point away, a basket away from advancing. You yes. know, so kudos to him and for your program coach. Hopefully, you know, we, we can just build from this. You got to keep building. Yep, that's where we're on building blocks right now, just kind of building and building. Um, and it's going to continue to grow. Yeah. I can feel it. Well, I'm looking forward to it, you know. So, Robert. What do you got to say, Rob? Well, you know, I'm proud of the Javelinas. You know, they were battling you know, oh, towards the end. Yes. You know, it is going to hurt. You know, uh, like you said, Bobby, take it in, you know, it's, you know, and then just move on, move forward, you know. Uh, but, you know, but uh, let's build on this. And it's, it's, I think overall it's good for the program. You know, we need to we need to be – we need to continue to go to playoffs, win district, uh, win the first round, uh, ship it away. And you never know, maybe, you know, one of these years we'll, you know, hit lightning in the bottle and – you yeah, know, and that's that you got to keep knocking at the door mm -hmm. to get in. You can't, you can't. Yes, keep, and, and, keep and not and not knocking. Mm -hmm. well, you know what I always tell people is success. You know, creates more success. You know, winning builds winning. You know, so hopefully kids out there watching, if you're a young lady, you know, on the playground, I'm glad for the athletic booster club doing those, you know, leagues. Yeah, the youth league is you, very. You, you want to have those kids get inspired, and and be, not nothing better than our own local youth kids. You know. I, yeah. I showed your video clip to my son every time, you know, back in the day. Oh. Say, like, you know, I, I rank you there the highest or the best running back of Chris City High School football. He says, hey, he practiced those moves. I, you know, I, I told him, I he just didn't just show up doing those things, you know. I remember you and, and you know, practice. I, I enjoyed going to you guys' practice back in the day with Coach Guzman and I think we even had Coach um, Gonzalez at the time, right? Yeah, we had Coach Gonzalez, Coach yeah. Ibarra, mm -hmm. we had Coach Alvarado. We had and, a lot of and great and coaches how, on and this Now staff. you said Hector. How's his boy doing? He's, he's doing still, good. He's still he's communication coaching, with him? Yeah, he's coaching there at Taft, linebackers and coaching yeah. track there. Uh, and uh, he was another key player, man, that, uh, as a linebacker. I enjoyed him blitzing the heck out of that. <laughs> you know. So, anyways, I have a lot of great memories of you guys playing 
the sport. So what I'm trying to say is that that's how you build. You know, you, you know, you might not know it, but you are inspiring others, and that's what we want the other guy's sports show to be about is about putting the talent of Chris City out there to the world. There's always somebody from Chris City all over the world. So yes, nothing sir. better than check it out on the other guy's sports show. And thank you for tuning in, basically. Right. Yeah, yeah, thank you guys exactly. for having me. I'll see you guys on Tuesday. Thank you, Coach, for everything. It was, it was fun. Thank yeah. you, guys. We'll, we'll be there Nation. Tuesday. I'll see you guys. <sighs> yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Coach, for everything. So, Bobby, what do you think? Uh, Any last words? or just a heart, It's a heartbreak, Robert, um, but I'm, I'm still – it's one of those heartbreaks that you're proud of kind of deal. Great job. Columbus just did what they had to do. They found number five on the paint mm -hmm. the last second. And, you know, cool collected, got the basket, and was enough to take them for the area championship. So well, yeah, it is. It is. So, but, uh, but you said it's tough, man. You know, you, know, you, you just take and, a moment. And, and, I, and I came in here thinking that the chances were slim for Chris City, Robert. No, no. I had, I had a 50-50 chance. I said, you know what? I think we have a decent chance to win. And, and clearly we did. And uh -huh. you know, it, it was just, it's just one of those things. It, yeah. We, great, great game plan. I mean, oh, man. I know. I know. It, I know. It, it's one of those. And we'll be, we'll be talking about this. Uh, Luck. <laughs> <laughs> hey, sometimes you, I I told my boy this. Sometimes you want to be luck, better, be lucky than good, <laughs> you know. And and that's what happens when we play in the backyard. Yeah. <laughs> when I get a basket off of him. So oh. hey, it is what it is. So bueno, let's end it, yeah, because it's a long trip home, and we'll be discussing this this game on the way back, Bobby. Yes. Thank you guys, and I love Crusade Nation. Yes, Hog Nation. We'll be tuning out. Uh, we'll be in Tuesday, hopefully. Yes. We'll be there. So check us out then. Other guys, Porto, tuning out.